welcome to the second part of this video in this particular video we are going to discuss the LRU algorithm or strategy and a quick recap what is LRU they assign all the memory blocks to all pages till our memory gets used up then they look for a page miss and we scan the string on the left side of the current page that we're talking about and we find out the page that is least recently used in the memory so in this case 3 is that page which we we'll replace and we have to simulate simulate a similar algorithm in our code so in the first part of this particular video we saw our FIFO strategy what we'll do is we'll copy our FIFO strategy and we'll make certain changes in this particular code to implement our LRU. Our replacement strategy was in this else block. So what we'll do, we'll just uh, erase all of this and here we have to implement our LRU strategy. So what is our strategy? Uh, we'll check the pointer, the string pointer that we have our outer loop. Uh, we'll run a smaller loop on the left part of our string from 0. So what we have to do, scan left string and check whether each page is present or not. This is what we have to do. So we'll maintain um, two arrays for our convenience. One is for keeping a track of the distances that we talked about, least recently used. The distance between 2 and 5 is 1, distance between 1 and 5 is 2, in the string the distance of characters that we are talking about. So we will uh, keep, uh, we'll keep a track of distances in an array and for my convenience what I am doing is I am uh, creating an array of 10 elements because I know my page numbers will range from 0 to 9 only. I don't have any other page numbers currently. So I will make an array of 10 elements. Similarly, I will also make an array of present. And using these two arrays, we'll find the least recently used page. So, we'll first initialize the all distances and present values to minus 1. So, we, uh, we'll be able to easily identify and differentiate between the pages then, in that case then. Um, our loop goes from 0 to 9. And all present of j will be minus 1 and all distances of at j position will be minus 1. Our arrays have been initialized. Now we have to scan the left string and check whether those particular pages are present. So first we will check for present, present condition. What we'll do is for each page, okay, from 0 to 9th page, we'll run a loop in our memory whether that page is present uh, in the memory or not. M size. If a page is present, if um, A memory of k equal equal to j. If it is present, then make present of k as 1. Instead of minus 1, it will be 1. And that way we will get a present array done. And after this loop, 
after we have our uh, present array in place, we will compute the distances. For that what we have to do is we have to scan the left string. Now left string would be if we consider 5 in this case a left string would be this. It would run from 0 to the uh, position where i is present minus 1. So uh, the position of uh, 5 is stored in i current i in a paid string that we are scanning. So I will run a loop from 0 till i minus 1 and uh, I will get the page number from the string int page is equal is equal to page string of j minus 48 because uh, I am converting the ASCII into a number. So using this I will get 1 first then 2, 3 likewise. I will get all of these numbers and uh, yeah, and we have to store their distances. So, distance of the page we have obtained will be i minus j, the distance in the string which we are talking about. So, after this our distances will be initialized as per their positions in the string. Then after that what we will do is we will find out the maximum distance Okay, the maximum distance for the page that is also present in the memory. So, int max is equal to 0 and we will keep a num number to keep a track of that particular page. So, uh, here yeah, we will we'll run a loop through our distance okay, our distances. And if our distance of j is greater than max and num, sorry, uh, present of j, that is the each and every page from 0 to 9, if the distance is maximum and it is present in the memory, if it is 1, then max will be distance of j and the page we are talking about num will be the page j. Here what we can do is instead of initializing it to 1, we will initialize it as k. So, we will obtain the uh, index where that page is present in our memory. So, here we, uh, we can do is if it is greater than minus 1, then all of this happens and once we uh, and after this we will have the, di uh, the maximum distance page from our current page and we have to replace that page in our memory. So, we will replace um, yeah. instead of this we make num as present of j. So, memory of num will be current page that we are talking about. Yes, and before the missing part, a page misses, what we will do is, we will check if our memory is really empty or not. So, else if mem pointer is less than memory size, we will keep on assigning the memory blocks, mem uh, memory of mem pointer equal to current and mem pointer 
plus plus and after this condition we will get into page misses and we will find the maximum distance page and we will replace it with the current page. Now we will test this particular code that we have written. Just a second, this was uh, the first one was FIFA, so this will be LRU. Mm. So, according to FIFA, this thing is correct, we had tested the sound previously. We will check it according to our next algorithm that is LRU. So up till this it is clear. In this case 5 should replace 3 but something else is going on. We will have to check our logic once again. Okay so this was the glitch in our code. This should have been present of J because uh, for each and every page from 0 to 9 we are finding whether it is present in the memory or not. So let's test this out once. So for 5 it should replace 3, for 6 it will replace 4, 0 replaces 1 and 2 is a page hit. So yeah it is working correctly. So we are done with LRU. In LRU we scanned the string on the left. Now in optimal strategy the last page replacement algorithm we have to scan the string on the right. Okay, we will scan the string on the right and the rest of the things will be same. We will uh, calculate the distance whichever has the maximum distance on the right side that is what we will replace. So we will copy our LRU function and we will make some changes to implement our optimal function. So in this case in optimal what we have to do we have to scan string on right. So I, all of this will be same for now. We are initializing distances and present numbers. In this case, we will run from i plus 1 till page string dot length. And we will initialize the distance as j minus i. Because here j's value will be greater than i. Uh, we are scanning the string on the right. So the indexes of j's will be greater than the i rest everything will be same. Yes, so now we will test this particular thing out. So let's first discuss how it will work. 5 
will replace 2 and for 602 as we discussed it is a page miss for all 3 so 5 replaces 2 that is correct but in this case uh, 602 uh, should have been permanent misses but they aren't so we will again check our logic in this what we will try to do over here um, we will check if our num has been initialized if num is greater than minus 1 only then we will replace or else it is a permanent miss like we talked about let's check whether this will work yes so 602 are misses and in each and every function we will print out the number of hits and number of misses see out so FIFO first FIFO hits so that we can compare the efficiency of each and every strategy uh, hit and number of miss page miss or page faults FIFO miss and similar thing in LRU and optimal LRU optimal uh, this is for LRU and below this yeah optimal optimal so let's compare all three of these in FIFO hits are 2 in LR you hits a 3 there is a slight fault in our logic in this particular part also there will be a page miss when our memory is not yet full yeah because the total of hits and misses should be equal to the number of characters in our string so that's why logic was a bit faulty previously so optimal and fifo are showing similar results in this case and lru is showing more number of hits so for this particular example lru is the optimum strategy so that's it for this video thank you so much for watching